It's defusal that's planted so deep for them. Yeah, that's it. I mean, Brian Sticker here, or they can do a spray on. So they're going to have to keep on trying to step it towards firefights here. A little bit of a whiff coming off down towards the south side, but it's all about the spike itself. So they bounce back and trying to stick. They've got three stacked up on it. They get it halfway that's done, the but the game. players just keep on falling side for side. It's down to a two versus two as Kiwi's found himself off towards the other. Will not be able to find anything here as now V. Side for the time being in a really nice setup here. Just holding shallow angles. Utility not really there to stall out onto the hit. Kiwi goes running in though, and now you can see it being thrown down. Not often you see the defensive side hold that in the post, but CNET able to find the one kill before the smoke goes up. That kill, Joy. Gets a full control of that side now, Na'Vi. They're chomping in the bit. They're ready and at the races here to come flying back in. And sure enough, the flood begins. Utility comes out straight in towards backside. They march. Men looking towards CNET here, who's got himself into a great position, but he's full flashed out at exactly the same time. Can do almost nothing with it. And all but collapses as a result. But now coming down to just two left standing for the side of foot, though. What more can they do? Last player standing. <laughs> Not much. That's the answer there. Just trying to play out from mound cracks. He's had some good performances, but get themselves good. onto the site here. Once again, Spike going down, so much more of what we saw back in those first two rounds. 19 seconds, all it took for the Spike to be dropped down, and now it's about Na'Vi's retake, which so far has been excellent. Yeah, this time taking their time a little bit more. This Viper ult is very hard to get into. Not really sure how they're going to make it happen. Uh, they don't really have Prowlers to try and hunt down in. They're using a very deep Killjoy ult they don't want to get pushed into. And that clears out Link again against the, the spawn push. The ult goes down, though, out of Captain Falls. That's what you're looking for as well. That suddenly clears things up and will open up all the firefights you need. But shock horror. That's what they're expecting. No. Well, in this case, we've got five players all looking to push on through. Started out as a small slaughter, a two for two. Really thought for a second we were going to see a good entry out of foot. Na'Vi did bite back this with this problem, one. Yeah. And sure enough, it's working out as well. Cracks finds the first one. Trying to do whatever they can. He's holding on to it as oh, well, no. surely. You can see him being tagged, but he one sticks it all the there. way. Manages to make it work, and once again... So, uh, he's just going to be looking for an early fight and then backing away at the last possible second. Full five-on-five five retake. All right. Oh, now, this is probably the biggest oh, challenge Na'Vi would have faced so far. Ult slayed on top of ults as well. As you hear, the KO will come out, but Zipan's already in and finds one. Marching in for the entry, finds a second. Almost spray transfers to revert, but it's Soy Getsu to pick things back up. Yet again, Na'Vi are in a three versus two. Cracks has to go huge here from backside. 2v3 has one flash to work with a knife in a few seconds, but that's not going to mean much. He has to fight for it and get at least one to give his team a chance, but now he's been spotted. And that's it. That surely is the death sign coming on through. They knew, but they know where he is. It's really the only trick they had left up there. Buck, and all we could see is Marge holding a range, trying to make this one work, but it's a real battle. Trying to play into this. Double so it's being gathered to the smoke. Oh, Gets two for himself. Oh. Finds a third as well. Here we go as well from the backside. It's Angel. He's always one of the first in the firefight. Even on the oh, over, no. snaps onto two, almost made it a third, but couldn't quite collect the whole way through as the all comes flying over the top. How has Kiwi got around here? He went all the, way, all the way through C. I mean, it's done something for him. Turns it into a one versus one. It's him against CNET playing up on high, but I don't think Kiwi fully knows where he is. Surely he will now. This round comes one. Spike in hand, he's down to 30 HP. It's 30 versus 40. And away he goes, rotating straight off towards C with a fast little feet of his. Plenty of time, but Tina is still sprinting him down here. Spike planted. Madness. Massive scrap broke out on B, and it's ending on C. It's holding the tight corner. Expecting the bat flank, but c -Ned, he's following up on short. Exactly where he last left him. But it's who wins out in the one versus one. Kiwi being so patient here. Waiting for the challenge to come on through first. Again, he's not 100% confident. But here feels ready, even finds the shot as well. As CNET falls a foot, do we go? The race is on. They've breezed past man. They're charging their way in towards C. And every single player of foot starts their rotate over as they realize exactly what's going on. But a great wall split site and really gives no recourse to the side of foot to bounce back in just yet. Zipan's in, Spike is going down. Oh, almost was down, but no! Sprayed out and it's three quick kills. Two of those coming from cracks. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> this will probably just turn into Kiwi trying to save unless Fallen gets some damage done. See, that's also very low HP. There's a world here where they can accomplish something as they get the kill through the smoke as well. Mollies are being used early. They need to get someone on the spike now. Trying to get to here as well. Spray comes on through. They've got the shutdown. They've got this one on lock. They know the read they need. 
to get this one taken out and locked down. Sure enough, two quick kills come on through, but it's a one versus one. Angel against Kraps with no times left on the clock. He tries to bait it out. Step it forward for the one. Angel will find this man and looks like no one's ready for this. That is just <laughs> gross, man. He was like, please, someone walk into me to make it have a chance. Now, Crax has popped the ultimate, trying to get active on the retake. Zipman falls, a Kiwi from the back gets one, but somehow still alive on site. Shao finds it, it doesn't matter, as Foot flood in. They're attacking Viper is spent over towards C. The post plant util not as effective. Oh no, oh no, not the toes, not the toes. It's all good. <laughs> He's still alive, left. and they'll know that Spike he's still landed. down here as well as the real battles to try and work their way through. But for all their concern, he's pretty much finished into this one. They cut off the support for three with the smoke coming on through. Great placement on that. Things are looking woeful for the side of foot here. Oh, and another player falls here at a captain with the sheriff finds his. Now they have to worry about tree and main. It's just planted for them. Fallen falls after trading one for one. Sugetsu coming around for a pinch in the back one corner here remaining. takes the one. It's all down to Captain, and it's not going to the opposite side of the map, but Navi are still working in the sea. Still trying to force their way through. I think at this point, maybe they realize. <laughs> they got okay. Kiwi charging his way over through Link here to Hold rejoin on. the side. But out of Captain's popping off. Finds two for himself. It's a numbers advantage for the side of foot. Now Navi have a decision, rotate away or stay. Yeah, they're going to walk straight into Mr. Fallen. He's got the Bulldog. If he can find one and fall, that is huge for the team. But Navi is still splitting their decision. Oh! Fallen finds the first four on left. two with 25 seconds remaining. All they've got to do is hold. <laughs> I would wager their utility strong. Yeah. Sorry, their economy is strong enough that they can, fall, they can risk a couple of fights here. They find themselves too. They're not going to be able to win the round, but the damage being Only done remaining. feels pretty significant. Sure. Oh, Fallen cleans up towards the end. And the follow-up could come, but I'm not convinced that Navi want to come oh, in on oh. this one. Oh, no. Two or three players staring through Who's that doorway, next? peeking through the keyhole, and they find what they're after. Oh, oh did he not see Captain? Oh, I think see when he turns around, it'll be fine. You see him towards the end here, comes out as well, straight away into a spray. Beautiful play from CNET, denying everything away from foot. They've only got one left standing. It was the makings of a comeback. But Na'Vi get it all in round 22. And how good is it? Zipan using the Nightfall, turning off the eardrums of every player on that site. So when CNED pops out of the ultimate, no one hears that. How long here, and with all of their smokes, they're gonna try to get in the dodge. Oh my god, the dash was whiffed, but CNED gets two kills. No, 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 it wasn't whiffed, it was a fake. Oh my god, it was bad. all intentional, right? Still, right. Sai yes. has been taken by foot, and the spike has gone down now for Navi. We've seen them be retake spike kings planted. on Lotus not too long ago. Oh. Pretty confident they could do the same oh, here. So, get to finding one, at least Kiwi all alone will find one for himself, but still three more to bring down. Yeah, it's going to be a tough one, getting flooded in backside, chipped oh, away. Ad finds the first, though. But where to look? One enemy oh, remaining. Oh, what? 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 Okay, he's got one left. Dancing each other around the back of sight here as well. He's rounding on the right side, but held out by the turret, but it's just not enough. Not pushing forward as the rest of the team is now rotating in, but if he falls, the whole round gets slaughtered. Oh, Zipan finds one through the smoke. And now where can you actually go with foot when your only rifle's abandoned on the site? The other one, now Xiao is pushing into, that's an overstep. That's a start, at least to bring things back for them. They have two players looking to push in here, as you can see. Out of captain, round in the corner, along with Moj, but it's all about that single play for the Diffuser for a second to go. So gets, he gets the clean up there, and so just one left standing, cracks all by himself. Na'Vi, just to cut this one off. He was going for the dash on in, steps into his own team's shock dart, searching for the kill in backside, instantly traded on through. Absolutely melted on the way through, yeah, but still down to a four versus four at this point. Foot fighting back pretty viciously and forcing their way through. They find a couple of players, that's exactly what they're looking for. The ultimate layered out from cracks as well on top of things. Zipan does bring one back, finds a second. That's the kind of play you want! Flix for number three! One left standing in backside. As Al says, out of counting. Wondering where his fallen teammates have gone. Try and stick this one now. Knows there's one of them in heaven. Make it two. As they double up here. He's going to see one, but can do nothing. CNED makes it four. They want to force it. They want to get rid of the ultimate, but they're walking into a bit of a slaughter. They played into this exactly the way that Navi wanted them to. They slaughtered three. And a what cost?
CNET holding up heaven when the smoke comes down, has to disengage from the play. Foot are not out of this just yet, but only 15 seconds. They have to commit to this plant right here. CNET's not going to let him get it off. Peeking out of the smoke, but Kiwi takes down one. Oh, this is danger. Kiwi finds a second as well. Stepping things back across is down to a one versus two. Zip with it all to do, and Kiwi is feeling nasty in this round. Steps forward for the one, and Kiwi finds the. Oh, okay. I don't really think. Oh, I was about to say, we haven't seen a full A main hit, and I don't think we're going to see it here either. Been completely domed on their way through. Still maybe going to try and commit as all four players are rotating over. What we've normally seen out of foot has been that split, sending two up through mid, two down through A main. For now, they're most committed in the same direction. Fallen picks oh, up no. the offer. It'll just be the next one in line. Spike At least it's traded. A. You're going to take that, I suppose, but there's still two players here on the site as all the smokes are going to be thrown down in here. Mid. And the suck at the back of side as well. No one, of course, currently sat on that spot. It's playing this one for one, one game, this game of attrition. It works in favor of Spike Navi. Down a. The ball Don't things down to a down. three versus one. And Mo just got it all to do. Arguably a little bit too much to do. The longer he waits, the more time the rotates come in. CNET arriving with the operator. Might just get the kill with the Molly backside. Respect. Oh, he finds him as well. Yeah. Hold on, he needs to play off the smoke. Take a chance, take a gamble. He gets the first one. <laughs> but it falls apart at the end. That's what a big part of the gameplay, I think, from Na'Vi. has been the aggressive up towards A. He's speaking about aggression towards A. But a force their way in. And they're trying to tear through Na'Vi to get themselves a couple on the march on through. This time around, the spike is going to go down. They've managed to make it work and have the numbers advantage. Angel missed a window to try and spam the planter there and get him off that one. Shocktar barely dodged. This one not the same. The positioning from Cracks is good, but Sugetu knows Captain is there. Everything being burnt out here to make it work. Wasn't aware of Sugetu getting up so close, trying to see what he could find the wall bang. But it's Mojo towards the side. Finds one, but instantly traded out by Angel. The back and forth is ludicrous. Cena finds one more. It was a one versus two, and it cannot be done. I'm going to see here with three players in main. If they can pull cracks off of Art, right, that's when the lurk can come in from Shao. Backside, though, Fallen takes the first, and this hit has been stalled completely. Our plans are getting quite shallow, though. They managed to get away with it as well. Almost. Plants is going down, but denied away at the very, very last second. But for now, at very least, hold on, and Navi are down a man. I mean, there's a lurking connector right now. Check out Sugetsu coming in for the backstab straight on to Moj. I mean, the timing there, they gambled two players on the lurk, but it means the spike is isolated in sight because the initial hit didn't work out. Away, but what else can they do with this? They've got 30 seconds to play with. They're going to try and make a plan happen here, but they've got to hold it and hold they shall. Down goes the spike, but Kiwi finds two for himself, making it third. He finds okay. yet another 4K. Three later in the round as well. Not bad play coming out there, but really it's all about the plan that has gone down. Shao's in hot water and finds himself toast through the wall. Perfect, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Spam through with the with the Sheriff Waits with the vulnerability on the suck there too. The plan confirmed, now seen it pushing on forward, taking a chance, taking a gamble, oh! but Kiwi sits him right down. Absolutely oh, dozed him from afar as well. Will not be stopped since we got back underway. This is feeling very reminiscent of what we saw back One on Lotus about an hour or so ago. That's what I'm trying to do here is forcing their way forward. Utility slowing them down slightly before they have the full send. And sure enough, a great little link coming out. Zenet finds one for himself, so he gets to into the second, but still keeps things even at three versus three, and that's what makes me nervous. HP has been chipped out hugely, though. Fallen also looking for some chip on the shock darts. He gets to so incredibly low, down to 11 HP. He knows he's going to be in the corner there. Kiwi and Moj team up to retake back through secret. Here's the, the first right. kill from Fallen, the second one as oh, well. Man. But are cruising on the retake, oh, just seen it. That's the problem. It's just seen it. In the one versus two. Makes use of the updraft as well as the smoke coming on through. Has to spray here. Uh-oh, no Off bullets. done. He's going to have to come in for this one to spray it down. Remaining Finds one. himself right one. On Kiwi versus CNET. Who comes out on top? It's going to be CNET. Of course it is. That's one ultimate air quotes wasted, really. Cracks is ready. CNET pulls. A second one comes in. Spike Can you smell mid. it? It's smelling like the collapse of Na'Vi. Three gone in the round. And foot move up to within touching distance. Two rounds to go. Not actually that. committing the Viper ult so soon. Kiwi tracks CNET down, finds it, and actually retreats all the way back up to heaven. Moj can just slam the pit on site as well, but they managed to work up so quickly, and the change of pace is perfect. But Footer still finding all the kills. Yes, great use of Izzy there as well to really open things up, but they put down Wingman which means that wasn't going down anymore. Charles going to have to take that up, but Kiwi, 
the Overseer from on high is just deleting the members of Na'Vi. Sure, they've got the spike down, but it's a five versus two, and it is a lot to ask for from this Na'Vi side. Make it one left. Kiwi, he must have heard what I said earlier on. Casino is definitely not gapping him anymore. Motion to the next. It's that a could be a problem for him. And comes the order as well. Detain landing on towards. He's going to have a time, though. There's no one really there to capitalize on. Oh, there we go. Oh, Finally, they chase second. him. They chase him down. Give him no recourse, no way out. It's a good use of that ultimate to capitalize. They found two. The thing is, I've seen Foot win so many rounds now from a number disadvantage. I don't think they're even scared of this one. It's cracks holding up nice and close. Waiting Here's for the more. step forward to come in. And there we go. Two come back the other way real quick. All comes out once again, but doesn't find the man they need. What did I say? They keep on winning from these numbers. Disadvantages. Angels all alone. They've done it again. This life is forfeit. They're still they locked down, down in the post plan. Right this is going to be huge. It buys them so much time. But not if Fallen wins the fight before they have a chance to pop it. That's the problem. They've got to be popping it around about now, really. This could run. be too late. Finally, it comes out here as well. Making use of Dizzy that finds absolutely nothing. Shot out of the sky, a bit of clay, pigeon shooting on the go. Wow, they're taking their time. They have the numbers five on four. Angel very low. So the clock ticks down and Angel's gonna take a forward position, but he can't win the fight. See, they tried all that he could there to try and find something, but nothing was to be found at all. Oh, look at all the old the smokes. And this is the problem the Viper's pit was on side. We clocked it earlier on. It's back on here, and they're trying to make it happen. So I guess who comes in, finds two, Angel another, but it's again the fight back. Side. And Cracks is bound to, but can do nothing. The ball, he's two, he's gonna push oh, on no. it. And he takes down Angel. Such aggression being shown, and it pays off for them wonderfully. Unplayable at the moment. Cannot be stopped no matter where he seems to be. Stepping their way forward, trying to look in here for a plan, and they get away with it. Ready for any potential swing out, and there is none. Navi once again get the spike down. Zipan trying to flash through the smoke back here, but that's another critical piece of utility wasted. Foot on the retake with fly. Five players are absolutely ready to flood out from CT. They go to the back, but Cena finds the first. He turns around the corner for the second. Now you're cruising. But it's back to the three versus three. And remaining. once again, it's an absolute slaughter coming out from Foot. Shao left standing, and he cannot do it. We have said 5v3 so many times, it's not going to be. I'm going to fall That's apart and say it one more time. Will not be stopped to slow up close. They can get in here. Across comes Wingman. Taken out, so that can't sit with it. know exactly where he is. Drops smoke. It's up close What's to the happening? They miss everything. Yeah. It's a one for one. They seen it ultimately coming out on top as Crack yeah. steps in. They've still got the bigger rifles, and they've traded over and got the up on Cena once again. But he's got to be able to find someone. Up in heaven, there's one. One posted down a little bit lower. Shao holding nice and close here. Knows exactly what's headed his way. Yet again, a two versus two in the post plant. We've been here before. CNET has an up, down, long, trained on the spike. It's the place to be. And they're pushing in for him at this point, they know. Going in for the double peak, almost gets wall banged out of it as well. Shao rounding one, but he misses the critical shots. CNET gets one, it's the one versus one. And CNET finds the 4K with the retrieve. He's got it all to do, he's got the rifle. But I don't think it's going to fully stop the onslaught of Na'Vi. Finds one for himself, all bunged out by Shao into a second. Na'Vi have got the 4v2. Again, we've been here before. They get the spray through the smoke. Managed to get it down as well. They can get back on it once again and try and make this happen. They've got to win the long range. The flash Fight came planted. through. He backs away and keeps himself stood up. Still in the four versus two. And it's on these last two players to make magic happen. No one backside. Two players in link. They have to go past. CNED playing so aggressively with that, they are oh, not no. ready for this. The gun has been spotted. The pinch is on the way. Fallen takes one, but he goes straight into two players. Wow. It is Zipan to finish. 13 to 11. And in the critical one versus one, CNED and Kiwi in the final round to kick it off. It is CNED that takes it and brings it home for Navi.